Also new at 6, an internal investigation into why Milwaukee firefighters missed finding a man in a burning house could take a year. Last March, a woman was rescued from that home on 26th and Locust. A man, however, was found inside the next day after a relative asked about his whereabouts. Months after the fire, what's left of the home has been torn down. But neighbors tell our Ann Sterling they still have questions about what happened. Five months after two people died in this house fire at 26 and Locust, neighbors still want to know how firefighters didn't see the body of 55-year-old Billy Bowen. His body was found the following day upstairs. I was appalled that it took 24 hours for them to find him. At least 30 firefighters responded to the house when it went up in flames on March 4th. According to the medical report, crews had apparently gone through the upstairs hours after the fire was out but didn't see Bowen. How could you miss? <laughs> I don't understand how they could miss somebody not being there. Not, I mean, somebody, a body being up there. Why didn't they catch the body the first time? You know, the firefighters should have caught it, but they didn't, they overlooked it. Bowen's grandmother was rescued by neighbors. She suffered severe burns and was rushed to the hospital. She died three days later. And I'm still wondering what happened to him because they never said what happened to him or what caused his death. Billy Bowen's final cause of death was ruled inhalation of soot and products of combustion. The Milwaukee Fire Department is still conducting an internal investigation, making sure standard operating procedures and guidelines were followed. We do have an internal investigation, uh, which is talking to all of the companies that were involved, talking to all the individuals that were involved, along with the particulars of that, that day and that event. Ann Sterling, today's TMJ4. The city's Fire and Police Commission is also investigating how Bowen was left behind.